Eugenia, it's great to be here at the Parallel Wireless Stand at Mobile World Congress Barcelona. Maybe you can give us a bit of an update on the work Parallel is doing to really drive Open RAN into the ecosystem, not just for 5G, but for all Gs. Oh, absolutely, such a great question, and also so good to see you. I think we haven't seen each other face to face. And I'm about smiling two, under here. I know, I know, me too. In about two years, I think the last meeting was at MWCLA 2019. So there was a lot of um, changes, there's a lot of changes that happened with Parallel Wireless, as you know, in the last two years. And we're now in more than 50 mobile operator networks. So what we do to drive that change is we address their needs. There's a lot of networks that still serve 2G, 3G, 4G, and 5G users. So addressing all Gs is important because no one wants to run two networks, right? One is the legacy one and then the open RAN. It's going to cost too much money because the promise of open RAN is to drive the TCO down. And that's why many customers coming to us to deliver just that, running 2G and 3G and 4G on the same open RAN system. And that's where our success came from from addressing those needs. And one of those most recent successes is an announcement you put out recently with the work you're doing with Axiata. Maybe you can tell us a little bit about that project. Uh, absolutely, absolutely. This is actually came out this morning and Axiata is um, an operator in Asia and they serve a lot of different countries from Sri Lanka to Indonesia. So it's a very distributed network. And users are different because in big cities, there's a lot of 4G consumption of data. And then in smaller villages, it's mostly 2G with a little bit of 4G. So they looked at parallel wireless to trial open RAN with possibility into larger deployments. Um, they looked to support all use cases from 2G in the villages to 4G in Jakarta. So I think this is sort of a persistent thing that comes up in conversations about Open RAND is, is it ready for dense urban deployments? And I think what you mentioned with Jakarta, I mean, obviously it is. Uh, absolutely it is, because let's keep in mind that Open RAND didn't start yesterday, or it didn't even start last year. Mobile operators, our partners, and Parallel Wireless, we've been working on Open RAND since 2014 and 15. So, and rural was the testing ground. When Open RAN got proven in rural, KPIs were great, business models weren't met, Open RAN was ready to move into urban. And urban, it's um, allowing mobile operators to optimize their networks to serve more users. So it's a natural transition. And you're giving a keynote presentation uh, tomorrow, I believe, and you just gave me a little bit of a preview. Maybe you can share the highlights with our audience. So the highlights of this presentation is I put a slide on the screen of a meal, and it has a soda, fries, and a cheeseburger. And I asked the audience, what does it have to do with Open RAN? And I know I asked you th that question, right? And I tell the audience a story about my son when I was explaining to him what Open RAN was and what Legacy RAN was. And I use that picture as an example that all you can get with Legacy RAN is that meal. And my son would say, how about chicken nuggets? And I would answer that question, no. If you want chicken nuggets, it's gonna cost you extra. And then my son would ask, how about a milkshake? I don't like soda, why don't we go down the street and we get a milkshake from a place that we like? And my answer would be with the legacy ran, you cannot do that kid because the first place is not gonna allow you. And he would go like, huh? And this is how our industry was before open ran. So that's a little preview. And then I steal a tagline from Burger King and I call Open Ran, Open Ran your way. Chicken nuggets, RUs, CUs, DUs, whatever you want to mix and match for your business case. 
Well, Eugenia, I really appreciate you taking the time to speak with us and for a deeper dive into some of the things we discussed today, I'd encourage everybody to take a look at a series of articles that you can contribute to us uh, on rcrwirelessnews.com, Open RAN 101. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you.